What's up team? I am super excited because today we're going to be taking that white oil that we extracted out of the mountain. So straight up out of the mountain was an abandoned well that was still bubbling up some natural gas and some white oil and some water mixture. And we went out there and we just captured as much of it as we could. It was just kind of a slurry of like dirt and water and, and white oil. And so we really couldn't see a lot of it. We could kind of see a little bit of it, but we went ahead and we extracted it out of there. And then I put it in these containers right here and then I let it sit. Now what's really cool and why I'm so excited is you can see the white oil now. You can see it so vibrantly clear, like right up here, right up top, that clear liquid right there that's kind of that kerosene-y, gassy color, that's the white oil. Below here is this like sort of like paraffin, kind of weird wax kind of thing. I don't really know what that is. And then here, this is all the water. This is just a bunch of dirty water. And then all the way down there, we got some dirt. So today, what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be extracting the rest of our oil from the top of this separation unit, this kind of thing that we just let just sit for a minute. And we're going to combine that and we're gonna make a little mini gas lamp out of this. The only time that we've actually recorded anywhere that anyone has ever done anything with this white oil was a hundred years ago. So we're sort of like rebusting this myth or like busting this myth for the first time. We're testing something that happened so long ago and it was all like hearsay. You're like, yeah, this guy did this thing a hundred years ago. We're gonna test that today to see if this white oil stuff is for real. And we're gonna be making a little tiny lamp. So not only doing that, but we're also gonna be making the world's cutest uh, gas lamp. So, um, you know, there's no way of, of doing it without actually testing it. So let's get this tested. So here's what we're gonna be doing today. I'm gonna take this, which is a uh, flavor injector. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cut the tip off right there because it's got little holes in it. We don't need that like pointed edge. I'm gonna cut the tip off right there. And then I'm going to suck up this oil, just that oil. Then once we have our white oil in this little container, we're gonna clear out one of these guys. I'm gonna pour it in there, beep. And then I'm gonna drill a hole. And I'm going to put a wick, a 100% cotton wick in there. Maybe that guy, it looks a little sturdier. And then we're gonna create a little mini gas oil lamp. Gas oil lamp? White oil lamp? It smells, it smells like gasoline. It reeks like uh, working with gasoline. So went ahead and bought these at the hardware store. Definitely don't wanna get the counter all uh, uh, gassy. What I might do is take the injector and squeeze a little bit more water in there so that I can get the layer of oil just up at the top there. All right, now I need to get below that surface, below the oil surface. Down in there, all right. This is kind of like fracking, actually, in a way. I'm bringing the oil to the surface by injecting water. Okie dokie. Wow, that's really good. That's actually great. Now, if you look down right on top of there, there's our oil. Like, that's our oil right there at the top. Now, how easy is that for me to suck up? That's a pretty good gauge, too. I can actually see how much white oil we really have. And that's a pretty good amount. Now all I gotta do is just stick the uh, syringe right down in there. Right, well, there it is in the syringe. Look at that. Wow. That is so amazing. That is such a good amount. And it's so pure. All right, so what we're gonna do now is I'm gonna put a little hole in uh, the top of this guy. And we're gonna use this as the starter for our little mini oil lamp. Mm, it might actually be just perfect. Yeah, there we go. Look at that. Perfect. I'm gonna go ahead and flop this down into the kerosene. And as it soaks up, we should be able to light it up. Soaking up our precious oil. It's actually soaking it up. Um, you guys can see it's actually quite wet now. It has, it has turned a different color. So what I'm gonna do uh, is we're gonna go ahead and give this a light, okay? But I'm gonna do it over here underneath the fume hood. Um, right on top of this pan. Because if uh, stuff goes awry, I don't wanna be the one. We have like a little vent there. All right, so we got a lot of wick right there. We got a lot of wick. Um, 
but it is actually working. Um, I can't believe it. It's totally working. But it's actually burning a lot of our oil. You can actually see it burning so much of our oil. See that right there? The wick's actually just really big. I'm gonna blow it out. I can't believe that. See, and like, it wasn't burning the wick per se, it was actually burning the oil. Incredible! I can't believe that! We took this right out of the ground! This white oil is legit. It's a real thing. We just made what presumably is the only white oil gas lamp, mini gas lamp, in the last 100 years or more. No one's done, no one has done anything with white oil in the last 100 years. The only documented source that anyone's had done anything with it was around like 1901. So there we go. So we're gonna go ahead and give this another light. I'm gonna show you guys that it is absolutely 100% flammable. So let's check this out. Burns dirty. There you go, can you guys believe it? We took this 100 year old legend and put it to the test. And it turns out, it's true. White oil is real. You can really take the white oil directly out of the ground and light a lamp with it, an oil lamp that we made. It is kind of a cool lamp, it's a little mini guy, but if we had more of it, we could have powered more things. I mean, that is just totally incredible. It's not crude oil. It's 83% it's, it's it's gasoline, directly out of the ground. Amazing! Um, if you guys like this video, go ahead and give us a thumbs up in the comment section below. Let me know. Were you guys super surprised that one, white oil even exists, uh, two, that you can actually burn this oil, and three, that you could power a lamp with it? If you haven't yet, hit that subscribe button. We have new videos all the time, and I'll see you guys really soon.